Hey everybody, welcome back to our channel and welcome back to another video. So today's video is going to be a kitchen redo. Um, we are, we, myself, my sister, and my friend is on her way over, are going to be putting in a peel and stick backsplash. So you guys know I spend a lot of time in my kitchen and food goes places. So what I'm gonna do is I ordered some peel and stick from Amazon and my sister is over here putting it together to see how it's gonna all fit on the wall. And we are going to redo the backsplash all the way in the kitchen, all the way around to the bacon area. And then um, we're gonna do a faux brick wall on this wall and a faux brick wall behind the coffee station just to kind of give some um, dimension, pops of color, uh, like an accent to the kitchen. So uh, we just thought you guys might want to come along as we do this little kitchen project. We'll tell you how much it costs after we finish up the project. Pretty economical, honestly. But we will let you guys know the price as soon as we are done. So can, before you start that, can we just... Let me start that camera. Okay, here we go. Right. Okay, so that comes off, all right? Mm -hmm. And it's just like, boom. Mm -hmm. You want it right there. Now, here's another option. Okay. If we don't like that option, we can do At like, the Walmart, mm -hmm. the peel and stick this. Where's the bag I have from Walmart? Oh, someone in the room. Oh. The one that looks like this, right? Mm -hmm. They had they had this pattern. Okay. But in this peel and stick okay. uh adhesive. Okay. Think that might be better? Same brand. Yeah, I guess. It might be in terms of not having to come back with more of these. You got to cut if right. you if you're gonna take it all the way up, you got to cut. Sl little slits. So you want to try that one? That, I think that, yeah, but they had it in this pattern right here. I mean, if you want to do, yeah, if you want to go with something where, because if you're going to send that back to Amazon, I'm going to do this right here. Yeah, I could send it back. All right, like we ain't never touched it. My face on it. It's okay. But, I yeah. opened up the dog muzzle and sent that back. So. And that has the lines on the back that you can cut, you know, okay. it has the measuring thing in the So then that will put you right yeah that much and then you would have to we would just keep it you know right all the way around to whatever that right okay so do you want to drive me to walmart you want me to drive myself it doesn't matter don't matter to me okay just watch your stuff i got you so we're right at about 56 inches come here Mm-hmm. come tell me you see where this line is right here? Mm -hmm. Do I need to go to that line or do I stay right here? 56 to hit. I want to hit the wall. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. I have the crown molding. But I'm right here. How high is that off of this ledge? Is it like right at the ledge? Or do I need to come down just a smidge? Um. Come down a little bit more. This, okay, so come down just a little bit beyond 56. So, this, so the brick's gonna be going yeah. up and down? Oh. They're gonna have to. Because that's how the brick go, right? In real life. You can't put them, you know what I'm saying? They, they don't go sideways, so like. No, we're just, we're just, so we're gonna be looking at it literally like this instead of on the wall like this. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna make that like this. Yeah. But she oh, she wants it from the crown molding. Oh, yeah. Oh, this piece for that. Yeah. No, she's going to get it. I was like, Randy, do you not understand what I'm saying? Okay, okay. I'm back, I'm back. I'm going. I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah, right. so, that makes sense. When you said crown molding standing there, I'm like, Lady, it's Kevin. Tell me. 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 Tell me.
Okay, so what I'm gonna have you do Go all the way to the yeah, top. Yeah, she's going all the way to the top. I'm okay. Going, I'm going it, so. Oh, so I can get my chunky butt up there? No, I don't want to. I got you. I got you. Well, yeah, I you. I gotta make sure it's squishy. Yeah, we're gonna use the side of this right here as the thing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Unfortunately, we are going to be filmed. And I'm behind the camera. I'm behind the camera. Oh my god. Please don't die. And then Please I can do it. I got it. Dude, I ain't worried about you got me. I'm worried about this ladder got me. Okay, so let's go all the way. Beautiful. How are we looking? Can we come? Are you are you flushing the um or you got overlap? Um, no, I'm not. Oh, actually, I need to come up a smidge. Go up yeah, a little, little bit more. Yeah, she just needs to go. It's up hard more. to tell because you know how you get the paint. Sometimes I'll hit the bottom of the thingy. Well, we have some. Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, so maybe that will come out. Right. So, so my thought is pull the top off down uh -huh. and stick all right. and then just pull the paper as we come down and smooth it down. All right. So in all fairness, since I'm taller, I guess I have to get up there. You said it, not me. I don't want to be up there. but I don't either. I know, but because I'm taller, no, I'll get up there. <laughs> oh, that side eye. You see what I mean? Okay. Oh, maybe we should turn this thing the other way. But just put it up there and seal it out first. Because for a second, it sort of felt like it was kind of coming into this. And so some of that is going to be, some of that is going to be the uh, actual um, construction of the house. I mean, yeah. they, they give, you know, you can be a sixteenth of an inch off and it'd be acceptable, you know. So, yeah, I'm saying because my dad, there are no right angles in the house. Yeah, there really aren't. So, like my right here, there, <laughs> there are not. There are not. Everything would have to be machine cut, you know. So even right here, it hits flush. Right here, it does not. 
You see? Yeah. So I was like, okay, you wiggle your fingers around there and tell me if you feel like this is. Yeah. Now, what does it look like at the bottom? If I, if I just do that. This side comes all the way down. This one is a little short. Okay. All right. <laughs> now, Nosey. All right. Now, tell me what it looks like. Still the same, but you have to remember we've got some lumps. Right. Okay. And sticker. All right. So I'm gonna try. To peel a little bit down. Oh, Lordy. I know. Yeah, it's sweating up in here. You guys make such a great team. Right. <laughs> keep, my, okay, keep my comments. Say my comments for the comment section. <laughs> okay, I got a wrinkle there. I can feel that. I guess I'm just trying to make sure we don't end up on the molding again. Looking good? So I would almost peel at a diagonal angle, maybe. Okay, right. okay, so let me come back here. I have sweat running as if. Look, we ain't even outside. I sweat. I okay. That's good. You want the book? I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna do it like this first. Okay. I'm still doing diagonal. All right. How am I looking? How am I looking? Yeah, you good as long as we keep. Okay. Okay. All right. So now, where's that book? Yeah. Do it at a diagonal too, as well. Oh, take away from the corners and end up with so much of a skew off the wall that um how long is how much how many feet do we have of that if we had to do it if I, what uh oh okay, okay. I'm, gonna, I'm gonna die um where where's the thing it said it was was it 12 12 by 20 
think about trying to get it in this corner. Okay. Right, and then you oh, roll it that way? Whomever, whomever can. Somebody may have to be on the other side of that line. Yeah, we're not in church. You can only enhance the in church. In church. In church. In church. Only. Where's the thing? Look, you could take this. You're going to do that? Look, Amanda. It's off. But it was doing so well. I mean, are you okay with a little? If you're okay with that, then we can match it match I'm here. perfect. Y'all are the perfect. ones who has these issues. But because we want to But I might put it. some curtains or something over there. You'll never know what's going to be over there. True. But let's continue. But it does look good, though. Very matched up. Very. Dumb ways to die. So many dumb ways to die. Ooh, look at Miss Landy. So refined. Refined. Yeah. So professional. Uh, yes. Professional. Sophisticated. See that? You got to pick your hands. I definitely got that. Did you get it, girl? Because the way she did that, like, she's a professional. You want to run it over? Twist it? Yeah. I'm glad this is peeling stick times 15. Because mm -hmm. um, as many times as we go up yeah, and down. Yeah, peeled and stuck it. Now let's see if it can. Ah. You got to put some of that. Uh oh, sorry. <laughs> put some of that. Ooh, that. That's what's going to cause bubbling. 
You guys see the wall up in person? You gonna put your coffee thing back up there, right? I am. And that's gonna hide. Excuse <laughs> me. That's gonna hide. No, not your head, but that's gonna hide. <laughs> I was gonna say, Charlie, nothing gonna hide my head. <laughs> <laughs> but that's the yeah, it can't. I'm good. Yeah, I'm good. 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 Right, right. My, my whole chin. Right. 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 She sticks it all around. What's and then I'll get love? the straight edge. Did he go by and cut that? He did. He did. For real? Uh -huh. Like he pooped or he peed? Uh, number two. Two for four? Yes. I think he peed. Now watch it. We're going to put the watch name back. <laughs> Oh, yeah. <laughs> Y'all are doing magnificent work. Right. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this moisture is the one that goes in the back. Probably. She might go in the front. I mean, that's why I told you. Ah, Jason. 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 Tell me you can come over here. 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 Tell me you can you ain't seen a flick. What's your name? Just look down there and see if that coaster is under that. What you mean? What you, what you mean? I mean? That's why little people exist. It's under there because it's rocking. Chicken. Well, it's not under something. Mm -hmm. We kicking it. Kicking it. Okay. I need a flashlight. Oh, okay. Just watch this stuff. Don't let this stuff fall. Don't get down. I'm not. 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 i am not i I thought it was going to close my final. Oh, sorry. The table just stabbed me. Oh, no. Did y'all get the back one? Oh, no. One of them is out. Is the one out over here? Yes. Oh, it's fine. What about back here? Shane, Shane. I love you. The fall back one. It's fine. Just shift that one under there. Here. Just put it under there, Jackson. I'm going to put it back to the wall. Oh, it's under there? Oh, y'all. <laughs> she does You know what? Do not. Like that. Come on, I don't. Probably need to be down, huh? 
Yeah. Hey, Ma. Jackson. Ma. Yes. Where are you going to take that? It was up here, right? Are you going to put that in there? Okay. This is a little bit of rough footage. I owe you two cuties. Jackson's not eating them. But they are delicious, aren't they? I put this whole thing in my mouth. I like to break them apart and eat it two by two. Jackson, we are you need still filming? Jackson, we need a hammer. I don't want to miss any funniness. Which... Are you making fart noises on my finger? Oh. <laughs> Ouch! Crap! That's crazy. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> do you have the orange peel in your mouth? What did you do? <laughs> what did you <laughs> yeah, they do surprisingly have seeds. Oh, wait. I th thought it was the big one. Yeah, the big ones have seeds. She washes her hands, y'all. Stay clean.
Alrighty, you guys, so here's a situation. I ran out of uh, paper for the brick. I have some, but not enough to cover the whole wall. So I could probably do about half. So I could probably do just that much. That has to be cut anyway. But I'm gonna order another roll and I'll finish that part out when it gets here. I ordered it and it got here pretty quickly. But Jackson and I are gonna move to the kitchen to work on the faux backsplash. And I'll walk you through that a little bit as well. Okay, so I did originally purchase the um, peel and stick backsplash that was like the texture, it actually looked like the backsplash. But they the l largest ones they had were 12 by 12 and this is 14, so I still would have ended up having to buy some to do the top part. So I actually ended up going back to Walmart and I found just some of this liner that looks like it. This will work out fine until I can price out the other one and really see if that's something that we want to um, invest in. But for right now, because see, we just have all these scratches and stuff just from living in the house. And um, it is what it is, but we wanna make sure that the house looks nice and clean. It also gives me an opportunity to kind of really um, wipe down and scrub down all the counters and all the um, appliances that were sitting up here and really streamline. I'm going to try to figure out how to go behind the stove because I really don't want to pull that out. Um, but something tells me I'm going to end up having to pull it out at least a little bit to get it down. So um, we're going to do it piece by piece. Jackson and I are just gonna measure from here to the wall and then from top to bottom and cut just that piece. And then we'll go around to the next section, cut just that piece. So we'll hopefully get these two sections done before um, we have to go pick up sister. Jackson, will you bring the ring light so I can have some more light? All right, so I've cut this to the measurement. And what I'm gonna to try to do is just sit it here to see. It is a little bit uh, longer than it needs to be. So I'm actually gonna just um, use my uh, cutter and uh, cut it off. So I'm just gonna bring it down so that it fits flush there. And then I'll use the cutter to get that bottom edge off, to get that extra edge off. So I think it's gonna fit fine. This has a little bit more of the green in it than I um, had originally planned on. I had planned on it being more brown, but the uh, countertops do have some green. So it should be perfectly okay. We'll see, we'll give it a whirl. And it's not a permanent. Um, we may change this again. Actually, Jackson, will you bring me the little scissor, the scissor again? So I'm just gonna cut this little lip off at the top. but I'm gonna need your help now.
to come through here and just pull that back sheet off as I try to move that way. Can you go around that way? I like that. That's didactic. That's very vociferous. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Vociferous. Jackson, can you hold that bottom half? Mm. Let's see. Get my hand in there. Oh, no, ma'am. That's what I thought she said. No, ma'am. Just trying to get this. Um, I have a, um, I've been using this thing. The yellow carb. Yes, ma'am. Jackson, I'm going to have to have you come over here and help. Alon. Alrighty, you guys, so the kids and I are done with our kitchen project. There we have a faux brick wall. Now I am gonna get something to replace our eat sign that was there and um, haven't figured out yet what. I went and looked for a few things, but didn't find anything that I love, love, love. So I'm gonna figure it out, maybe head to Hobby Lobby or something and find something to go there. But I did wanna bring you up close and let you guys see the kitchen. So there is the kitchen. And I'll tell you where I got all the things. And then I'll finish you out over here by the coffee station. And so that was my original. That was what I was going for. That sparked everything. I wanted to have something different behind my coffee station. And so I actually found some faux brick uh, wallpaper peel and stick on Amazon. I'll link it down below if anybody's interested in that. And um, it just works out from the, from the door. When you walk in, you're like, oh, I really like that. Um, 
I had a friend come over the other day and she's like, Shakiba, that looks lovely. I was like, yes. And so then I was thinking, okay, that wall is good, but I also have this wall right here. And so I'm kind of going for the warmer, uh, just lived in, I don't want to say farmhouse because I don't live in a farmhouse. I just wanted to do something a little bit different in my home and make sure that um, because I'm not able to do certain things because of price points, you can still do nice things for your house um, on a budget. So the I had to end up buying two rolls of this uh, wallpaper here. They were $19.99, so that was $40. So I spent $40 on the wallpaper. And then we had purchased, we, me and the kids, had purchased the peel and stick backsplash, but it was only 12 by 12. And this is more like 14, between here and here is more like 14. And I would have, and that was $39.99. I would have had to get three of the, three packets of those, which would have been, um, it would have been 120 bucks to do this backsplash. And so I was like, man, that's a little bit expensive. I wasn't not going to do it. But then my sister kept saying, because it only came up to 12, we would have had to buy some extra pieces to cut to fill out the extra two inches at the top. So I said, let me go back to Walmart. And I actually found contact paper. This was $5.46. I used one complete roll and I bought an extra roll just to have just in case I need to replace. And then right here, see where I just kind of cut a little bit crazy. I could actually um, trim that out just a little bit more, but I didn't want to damage the wall. So I just left it. Um, we did go back and fill in that corner space uh, there. It doesn't match up perfectly, but with the KitchenAid there, you can't even tell. And then I was trying not to move my stove just because I don't have a comfort level moving the stove. I could move it if I wanted to, but I was trying to do the least. And so also at Walmart, I found this corrugated uh, piece. It's really large. It's probably from the top here down to the bottom of the stove. It's a really wide piece. And that was $5 and 46 cents as well. So in my kitchen, I have probably spent $11, $51-$52 to get the new look that we have of the kitchen. And to me, it looks great. I love it, the kids love it. Um, people who've come in absolutely love it. And we hope that you guys love it as well.